what is up YouTube all right guys so today I'm gonna be taking you through the hedge lab here I actually realized that I don't have a hedge lab walkthrough on my channel yet so uh, yeah we are in the bottom right hand corner of the map here in the hedge area stay pre expedition checklist before you embark here I do recommend something spicy, whether that be the spicy Coltana or the spicy Antlion Greatsword, as you will be fighting a lot of spiders. If you don't have those weapons, that's okay. Uh, it's a pretty easy lab. The enemies aren't that difficult, so if you don't have those weapons, don't worry. I do recommend the crossbow, though. Uh, it's super OP in this game right now for whatever reason, so I do recommend that. Healing items, you don't need that many healing items you do pick a lot of fiber bandages up along the way uh, but they're pretty cheap and uh, it's nice to have a few going into it armor I do recommend some kind of armor maybe just repair it before you uh, go in but yeah so bring some kind of armor whatever that may be I'm using the ladybug armor you can decide for yourself so we're gonna do guys you're just gonna follow me this way Oh, also, definitely make sure to uh, have some kind of hunger and thirst. Maybe get some food items, have a canteen or two. I actually do think that they made it so you can edit the survival settings, I think. No, I'm not 100% sure about that. Somebody told me that. But uh, if that is the case, that would be, uh, be kind of cool. Alright guys, so we're going to be aiming for this route right here, and we're going to head directly like we're going to the Broodmother boss. What we're going to be looking for here is a green paperclip. You're just going to want to hop on the stick adjacent to it just to get to where we're going. You hang it right here. There is a field station coming up. You can go in there. There are some granola bars and a research note if you want to snag bad stuff there. And guys, I like to say aim for the mushrooms. So you're going to want to follow the mushrooms here. Uh, kind of takes you directly where you need to go, in a sense. Jump there. It actually stops you. Some spiderlings. We're going to be looking for our first zip line here. <laughs> All right. I want to run this way. Gonna hop on these mushrooms here, and we're gonna hang it right. Be careful with your jumps. It's pretty easy to fall here. All right, and we have reached the first part of the lab. In this part, you're gonna find the first scabby here, which is the bug juice scabby. There is a research note over here that you can snag if you do, in fact, want that as well. And, last but not least, some granola bars. Alright guys, we're going to run this way. And then we are going to hang a left onto these mushrooms here. And you will find your second zip line. Kind of a cool aesthetic here. The Broodmother boss will be on your right. There will be another scabby on the frisbee here. I already picked it up, but uh, it's pretty easy to notice. All right, and our third zip line. You will find some spiderlings in here. Fiber bandages here that you can snag if you do in fact need those. Oh, there's one alive. Alright, then what you're going to do is you're going to take an immediate left out here. And we're going to jump on this leaf here. And take this stick. Be careful not to fall here. Just going to take it up. Some raw science up there if you want to traverse the branches for that. And hit the zip line. 
and we have now reached the main lab area. I'm gonna slap this scanner here. All right, and you have activated the door system override. So what we're going to need, guys, we're looking for four different password scribbles here to activate this and successfully obtain the burgled chip in there. All right, so you're going to hit this, and it will activate the door here. You can go through here. There will be a Spiderlean and an Orb Weaver Jr. in the next room. These hedge spiders are up to no good. <sighs> so once you do in fact clear those enemies you can go in here you will find a resource analyzer and a workbench here if you do in fact need to scan something or build something some more fiber bandages sitting here floating if you want to grab those and you will find your first password scribble here you pick that up and then you're gonna want to run this way i like to go this way first and you can smack this to open this there will be taz bots on the other side though so bear that in mind and what you're gonna want to do is i like to drop down this way first onto this leaf and then you're gonna want to walk onto this branch here and jump and hit the zip line here there will be some spiderlings in here so once you slay those, you will find your second password scribble right here. Also in this room, what you're going to want to find is the ghost mint scabby, which is located here. So once you grab that, you can run this way. Open this room here. You'll find some more Taz bots here, so just make sure you're prepared for that. And then what we're going to do, guys, is we're going to run up this way here. Kill the Taz bot. Make sure to pick them up. I haven't been, but make sure you pick them up for the raw signs. So once we do in fact reach the berry murder scene here, you're going to want to run to this zip line and jump on that. The branch will block you, but that's all right. You just jump back on it again and kill the Tazbot down here and you will find your third password scribble here. Snag that real quick and then you're going to want to drop down this hole. Just make sure you don't drop down before you pick up the scribble. So you want to aim for the mushrooms over here. There is another lab entrance. I'm gonna jump in here. I'm gonna run up this way. And then instead of hanging a left up here, you're gonna wanna hang a right once you get to this point again. Alright guys, so this takes you up to the materials room. There should be two spiderlings, but I guess there's not. Anyway, once you hit this zip line, you're going to want to aim for that open lab entrance right there, alright? So you're going to hit this zip line, make sure you hit control when you reach it. And then what you're going to want to do is you're just going to want to drop down into it. And you will find your fourth password scribble right here along with some spiderlings. Make sure you kill those. Some more fiber bandages here if you want to pick those up. And then you will find a recording here that you can pick up as well. That is totally up to you if you want to listen to it. I'm not going to pick it up because it is a very long recording. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to run this way. Destroy the web in here. And then you have gone full circle here. So now that you have obtained all of the password pieces here, you can simply just smack the door system override and it will allow you to access your hedge super chip. 
Snag that and the control room note here. And then what you can do is you can activate the hedge zone. Alright guys, thank you so much for tuning in to my hedge lab tutorial here. If the video was in fact helpful, please drop a like or comment, that always helps me out a lot. Thank you guys so much and uh, have a good one.